When it comes to hurricanes, I'm sure it comes as no surprise that South Carolina is one of the top five states that gets hit the most. But how does that affect us here in the Midlands in the Lexington, Columbia area? Hi, I'm Crystal Jennings, your local realtor based here in Lexington, South Carolina. I'll be coming on here once a week to talk all things life South Carolina, what to do here, tips for buying and selling here, and my honest perspective of life here as a transplant myself. So today I wanted to talk about hurricanes because I get a lot of questions about hurricanes. People that aren't from around here, they think South Carolina and they immediately think like hurricanes, which is reasonable because a lot of times when you hear about major hurricanes, a lot of times they're either hitting South Carolina or somewhere around South Carolina, be Florida, Mississippi, it's we're, we're just in that area of hurricanes. So I wanna talk a little bit about Columbia specifically. So while we get hit with hurricanes, probably yearly, yearly there'll be something on the news that a hurricane's coming through. And a lot of times by the time it hits, uh, hits the coast, it's dwindled down. It's like maybe a one or a two, and they just get a lot of rain, some wind damage, water damage down there. We might get rain here, maybe it'll it'll rain for the day or for two days it'll just be heavy rain and that's it so since 1954 there has been three major hurricanes that has affected the state of south carolina tremendously catastrophic winds flooding all of that fatalities so 1954 we did have hurricane hazel uh, massive damage to um the South Carolina, North Carolina border. So it kind of came through right at the edge and then went up towards Virginia. So Columbia didn't get too much of that, anything that I could find anyway. They just got a tropical storm basically from that because it was just so far away. The 1959 came Gracie, which was a lot more catastrophic to specifically South Carolina. There was 10 fatalities. Um, it came through near Beaufort. By the time it hit Charleston though, it dwindled down to a one. And then by the time it hit Columbia, it was a tropical storm. Like I said, 10 fatalities, none in Columbia specifically. It didn't really spe specify which areas there was the fatalities, but I couldn't find any for Columbia. Um, but there was about $14 million worth of damage in South Carolina alone, which in 1959, $14 million worth of damage is, was, was a pretty big number. So there was pretty significant damage then. So we do have um, a lot of locals that remember this third one, which was Hurricane Hugo. Hugo came in in 1989, and that was the worst one that South Carolina has ever seen. There was millions of dollars worth of damage, uh, mainly from the winds. By the time it got to Columbia, the winds were still 99 miles an hour. So it still was about a category one. And by the time it hit Columbia, there was one fatality here in the Midlands from that one. He was in his car, it was a tree from, from the winds. Um, but 13 total deaths in South Carolina combined. So that was 1989, that was about 30 something years ago. And we've not had one since. We did have a big um, flood of 2015, which was, it was October of 2015. We hadn't been here for very long. I think we were here for maybe a year or two. And the whole city was underwater. That was more of a, literally a perfect storm because it was Hurricane Joaquin came up from the bottom and there was a storm in the north as well. So when they kind of hit together, it was, it was just a lot of rain and we just got flooded. There was a lot of damage during that storm. So as far as hurricanes go, by the time they hit, it gets to us in, South, in uh, Columbia, it does dwindle down. There was Hugo, which was 30 something years ago. We've not had anything like that since, but I'm not one to say that it won't happen again. Um, our hurricane season is between August, September, and October. And you don't, we just don't know if it's gonna happen again, it, it, but it can. Is it likely? Not really. There's only been three in the last 70 something years. So, 
take what you will out of that information. If you, now, if you do move towards the coast, you are gonna hit, get hit with some hurricanes. There's lots, tons of hurricanes that come through every year. They're, they're equipped for it a lot better than they were back in the 50s, 60s. Anyway, that was my take on hurricanes here in the Lexington, Columbia area. Hopefully that helped you understand hurricanes a little bit more in our area. If you have any questions about anything, shoot me a message. Anyway, I will see you next week with another video.